Good morning, this is Roscoe here, Roscoe Game. Welcome to the Coliseum. Hope you skybox are comfortable every single way. It's bright and early here, actually about 10 a.m. And uh, we're going to talk about Viking Clan today. Yes, Viking Clan. A little screenshot, what it looks like. A couple things they put in there. This is off of Facebook, and you can go on Google search and find it as well. I'm going to play the game. Click here. It takes a couple seconds to load in. It's a simple little app. It's a click, click game. It takes hours to play. Every time you click on a village or whatnot, it takes about an hour for most things to generate and whatnot as well. Every day you load in, you have to start out basically with your village. You have to, this is your village that you see here. I'm at uh, level 25 right now. I've been playing it for about four years. I never put any real money into it to buy gold or anything like that at all. I uh, go out in the, uh, down the bottom in the middle here, it says global map. You click there and you can go and uh, march out, grab stuff, and then come back. Sometimes you get in battles, lose troops and whatnot. You got to build armories, build troops up. You go to the troops over here, and you can see your different uh, troops you can buy as well. So you got different classes. You got to go in and uh, where is it? Oh, yeah. Here it is. Training. You just pick which one, and uh, you got to go to your main palace, pick profiles and skins, and you got to level everything up. It takes a long time. It's hard to get in there and explain it 100%, but this is years of playing the game. And you just go out here, like I said, to the global map, and you find little places. You can attack your local neighbors. Most of these guys are my what so-called friends on the game. They don't attack me. I don't attack them. But uh, you just click on a dirt mound. It says 43K. And you basically just go like this and uh, figure out how many troops. Hey, we'll make that a little less. And uh, bam, 48. That way there's some extra. Out they go. So... You just find little pockets. Sometimes you find a couple million pieces or 100K. My suggestion is you, uh, when you find a big one that has a million resources at it, only send about 400,000 to 100,000 off the beginning. It just They move a lot quicker if we're sending out there. On the left side of your screen, you see these little treasure chests. You open it up. You claim your daily prize or whatnot. If you go up here to clans, the next one up that looks like a rolled up notepad, you have to go in there and hit clans, hit all the starts. You get your daily tasks too. It just gives you extra wood and whatnot as well. So just cl keep clicking on the starts every day. It helps too. Up top right corner, it says bank. You got to hit that as well. You get gold as well, and you need that gold to buy stuff. Suggestion is you keep that gold that's up here in the corner. Just keep it. And here, make sure you're always over here. Once you have enough gold and uh, make sure you have a peace treaty, which is down right now. And uh, buy your peace treaties. Always have a peace treaty on there. As much or as high as you can go. We're going to apply a couple weeks. There we go. And uh, we got one week up here, it says. And we're going to buy because we got gold two weeks, three weeks, just in case I forget. That protects your base and whatnot from being raided and uh, so forth. That way you can build up your stuff. Like I said, this is about uh, four years of building with uh, no money put in for my debit card on here to buy extra gold. So there you go. And you have all different types. You got a Charmin up here. You can... Level up, change around as well. Add things to it. And, uh, can we do anything else there? No, we can't. And you got this big mystery thing up here as well. You go in here and you march around and you get different stuff as well. You can level up. It's just that big, big hidden castle. But uh, basically, click on your palace. You want to upgrade it. It tells you what you have to upgrade next. So the Oracle, to do the Oracle, you have to do the workshop level 25. And uh, I don't have enough wood, iron to do it. 
but I can spend 390,000 gold to do it. Bam, but I'm not going to do it. I'm going to wait till I got uh, my wooden resources. And wooden resources up here in the top corner. If you hit the plus signs as well, you can see that you have the bonuses. Like I said, when you hit the start, they give you stuff. You click more and that you get all that that you have in your bank. So you can use it at any time and save it up as well. Anyhow, that's uh, Viking Clans.